since Ed Woodward took over at Manchester United they have flexed their financial muscle with reckless abandon in an attempt to get back to the top of English football. They changed their transfer policy and now rely on youth and Manchester United's famous pipeline of young talent and now mainly recruit from abroad. Luis Van Hall and Jose Mourinho has both spent incredible sums of money and yet still Manchester United are not even a quarter of the quality team they were under Sir Alex Ferguson. It appears now that the board have begun to learn their lesson. Money helps but it certainly does not guarantee success. With Jose Marino's team in a not-too-close second the board have informed the manager that he will need to make some adjustments to his squad before he can buy further reinforcements. They absolutely want the wage bill to come down before they spend more money. He's to at least put a stoppage to the inflating wage bill before players can come in. According to the BBC United's wage bill had risen by 13.5% to £263.5 million in the last season, that's a rather untenable business model to say the least. Since Jose Mourinho has taken charge at Manchester United he has spent an incredible £285 million. The feeling around Old Trafford is that the team is not quite meeting the level of success that they'd expect for that level of investment. The good news is that Manchester United have a large amount of players whose contracts will be running out at the end of the season. They can easily find a way to factor that in and keep the wage bill in the black.